Today, Japan is the world's largest importer of LNG, with an energy self-sufficiency rate of no more than 8%. ICTHIS is a large-scale LNG development project that INPEX has driven for the last 20 years as Japan's first-ever operator of a project of its kind and scale. With a mission to deliver a stable supply of energy, this large-scale LNG project of global proportions and significance is now on stream. Since acquiring exploration rights in 1998 and discovering the giant ichthys gas condensate field off the coast of Western Australia, INPEX has built up the ichthys LNG project over a period of 20 years as the first ever Japanese operator of a large scale LNG project. Following exploration, engineering and construction work, production of gas began in July 2018. In October 2018, the LNG tanker carrying the first shipment of LNG from the ICTHIS LNG project departed Darwin in the Northern Territory of Australia and arrived at the INPEX-operated Naoetsu LNG terminal in Niigata, Japan. The ICTHIS LNG project, which is expected to be operational and deliver energy over the next 40 years, is scheduled to produce approximately 8.9 million tons of LNG and approximately 1.65 million tons of LPG annually, as well as approximately 100,000 barrels of condensate per day at peak. The ICTHIS LNG project's annual output of LNG is equivalent to more than 10% of Japan's annual LNG import volume, and approximately 70% of ICTHIS LNG is destined for Japanese buyers. To implement this large-scale project serving as a key link between Australia and Japan, INPEX built an unprecedented system to develop, produce, and transport hydrocarbons. The Central Processing Facility, or CPF, gathers hydrocarbons lifted from several thousand meters below the ocean floor and separates them into gases and liquids. The CPF, designed and built specifically for the ICTHIS LNG project, is one of the world's largest semi-submersible offshore production facilities. The Floating Production, Storage and Offloading Facility, or FPSO, receives the liquids processed at the CPF and separates an ultralight crude oil called condensate from water and other impurities. The condensate is then stored and eventually loaded onto tankers for shipment. This giant offshore facility, about 340 meters long and 60 meters wide, is similar in size to a very large crude carrier and is capable of storing more than one million barrels of condensate. Meanwhile, the gases processed at the CPF are shipped to the onshore gas liquefaction plant in Darwin in the Northern Territory of Australia via a subsea gas export pipeline that is approximately 890 kilometers long and ultimately delivered as end products to customers in Japan and around the world as part of a development, production and transportation cycle on a scale that is hard to imagine. With the production startup of the ICTHIS LNG project, INPEX, as the first ever Japanese company to operate a large-scale LNG project, has succeeded in building a gas supply chain infrastructure linking its self-operated LNG development and production assets to its customers across Asia, including feeding its own natural gas trunk pipeline network in Japan. Starting up the ICTHIS LNG project, lays the foundation for the sustainable growth of oil and natural gas e &P activities, one of the three key business goals laid out in INPEX's long-term vision 2040 and puts the company on a trajectory to become a top 10 international oil company. The ICTHIS LNG project and the natural gas trunk pipeline network in Japan also provide INPEX with the knowledge and the tools to develop natural gas markets in growing economies across Asia and beyond. Looking ahead toward 2040, INPEX will pursue the development of a global gas value chain business, aiming to be a key player in natural gas development and supply in Asia and Oceania. With demand for energy growing continuously worldwide, INPEX, as a leading energy company, will continue to contribute to the creation of a brighter future for society through its efforts to develop, produce, and deliver energy in a sustainable way.